Hello friends, welcome back to our channel. So in today's session, I would like to show you a one more option in Excel that is text to columns. So here the name itself indicates the text can be converted into different columns. That means text can be split into different columns based upon the given delimiter. Here delimiter can be a spaces, a span symbols or a characters, whatever it may be. We can give anything as a delimiter so that based upon that delimiter, the text will be divided into different parts. So here I have taken few example, a few names. So you can observe uh, every name is having two words and some names are having some three words. If I just want to divide these things into different columns, that means if I want to get a first name and last name among this one. So instead of retyping the words first name and a second name, you just select this one and go to the data. So in the menu bar and here you can find the text to two columns, the option text to two columns, right? So click on this one, see you will get uh, two options delimited or a fixed width. First I will go with a delimited and I will, I will explain about that. So here you can observe the data. So whatever the data you have selected that will be appeared here itself. So you can observe here. So select that one and click on the next. First I have given with a delimited characters such as commas or tabs separated each field. So next, so here you will be finding the delimiters tab or a semicolon or a comma or a space or any other special symbol, right? See. So if I go with the tab, so there is no tab space, so it was not uh, divided. So just to see here, the words are divided with the space. So I will go with the space. Okay. I will just remove the tab. So you can find here the preview. So Sandeep, will be printed on one column and Sarathi will be taken to another column because two words are separated with a com a space. So wherever the space is there, that column will be divided, the text will be divided, right? So coming to the last one, you can observe there are two spaces. So here there will be two divisions. Okay, so the data will be divided in three columns, right? So wherever the space is appeared in, the, in our word, that will be divided. So you can observe here. So click on next. So click on next. So here you can go with the column data format in which type of format we need to select. It is a general or a text or a date format, whatever it may be. So I'll go with the general format and click on finish. And you can observe here. So Sandeep Saradi is divided into Sandeep in one column and Saradi in another column. Pavan Kumar is divided as a Pavan in one column and Kumar is another column. Similarly, Srinivasa Ravi Kishore. Srinivasa is one column, Ravi is another column, Kishore is another column. Because these three words are divided into two different spaces with the two spaces. So that's why two divisions will be there here. Right? Ramachandra Rao is again having two spaces, so it will be divided in three columns. So, like this, we can divide the text into different columns. So if you are having See, here if you are having the differentiation with a roll number, some, some, some sort of number, okay, some ID, let it be some ID, 102, 103, and here also I will go with the 104, okay. <laughs> just select this one i just divide i just want to divide the name and number so select this one go to the text to columns delimited and give the see here we have divide we want to divide the name and number so with the help of delimiter is hyphen so go to the hyphen go to the hyphen here so other go to the other and hyphen give hyphen here next and click on finish so that it will be divided the name and difference Okay, the name and number has been divided. So similarly, similarly, see, I will go with these four. So I just want to go with this this, uh, this one, delimited. And if you want to go with uh, any other value, so let it be K. So select one uh, next. K, okay next and you can find finish so that wherever the k is there that will be divided see 
okay shiva followed by k so k is there so it will be divided into another column so like this we can divide by using any delimiter any delimiter and here you can observe one more uh, function so that is treat consecutive delimiters as one so for example for example here we are having some two hyphens two hyphens right see i will select this one and go with the text two columns delimited next and if i am not selecting here and i am selecting here with a uh, simply hyphen you can observe finish you can observe there are two divisions because two columns are there right so here there are two columns so that's why two divisions has been appeared so if you select even even though we are having the two columns if you select this one so delimited and go to the other hyphen and treat consecutive delimiters as one so consecutive how many delimiters are there no problem treat it as a one we are clicking on this option right if you click on this option automatically the even though we are having the consecutive columns uh, automatically that will be considered as a single one and it will be having the single division right so like this we can divide the text to columns and one more thing you can observe here i just i will go with this three and text two columns so instead of going with the delimited go with the fixed width fixed width so click on the next so a pointer is appeared here you can observe here right so you can just drag this one up to where you want to delete i mean up to where you want to divide see the first to create a break line first you need to specify or set the break line so click on the dash in position and to delete a delete a break line double click so if you want to disappear it just double click on this one so it will disappear right and see to move a break line click a drag it so click this one line and drag it so i will just drag to here so that if i go with the next so it will divide to that particular position right otherwise once once again i will show you so go with the fixed width next so i just want to go with the k okay two words k u k u k i okay next and click on the finish you will get k u k u k i and the remaining words will be here so instead of giving the delimiter we are just giving the width specified width in order to change the word i mean convert the text to columns divide the text right so this is how we can apply the text to columns so this this is mainly used when you want to uh, divide the first complete name as its first name middle name and last name right so th this this process is very easy to divide the text into different columns based upon the delimiter or with a fixed width right so hope you understood this one if you are having any doubts regarding this text to columns feel free to post your doubts in the comment section definitely i will try to clarify all your doubts and if you really enjoyed my session like my session share my session with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel thanks for watching thank you very much